I'm here with Dalton Caldwell, uh, CEO and founder of Pick Please. Hi, Dalton. Hi, how's it going? All right, so we're going to run through five questions. Um, let's start with Pick Please. You're here at South by Southwest. Are you seeing any um, you know, big traction? What's going on? Yeah, it's, it's actually been going really well for us. Uh, we've seen, we've set uh, record breaking sign up days the past few days. Uh, Android has continued to grow a great deal, and it, the cross platform strategy has really paid off for us. And the, the new the new features we launched with Borders has been really popular uh, with user base. So, you know, so far so good. We're really we're really pleased. Awesome! Can't wait to see the actual stats and see what happened. Sure. Um, so this is your second time around. You're a little bit older. Yeah. How has this changed your approach to to founding, starting, and you know building a product? Sure. Um, I think the biggest change in approach has been appreciating the process and trying to have fun uh, because startups are so much of a roller coaster. There's so much uh, ups and downs, and you have to just enjoy the process and enjoy the ups and downs and embrace it. And uh, remember that because at the end of the day, you talk to people that have done incredible, successful things, and people who started have worked out. Um, it's actually not the outcome that they talk about that they miss. It's more about the moments of the ups and downs in the process. So I'm just trying to embrace having fun, shipping code, working with my team, and. Are you more laid back? <laughs> I think so. I, yeah. I think part of that is being a little bit older. So okay. You mellow out when you get a little bit older. <laughs> All right. So obviously we're here at South by. Have you seen anything that like really strikes you um, this year? Yeah. Uh, it seems like actually in my personal network that um, the group me is breaking out, and I, I've had an account for a little while, and I finally, I finally see enough people signing up. Um, that it solves the network effect problems of chicken and egg, mm -hmm. and I'm finally getting a utility app. And that's what's so hard with those apps, right. getting enough people signed up. And I'm finally seeing, okay, I get this. This group messaging thing is kind of fun. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, we actually, we use it too. Um, your background though is online music, yeah. right? With iMeme. Um, of the online music companies out there, the startups and kind of the, the Spotify's and the RDO's of the world, who do you think has the best chance to succeed and, and be a lasting company? It really depends on the long-term economic models, which, are, which are, are unknown. I think in terms of just a pure product basis, Spotify is a really nice product. Um, RDO is a really nice product, and you've seen, from, in terms of product innovation, lots, lots of innovation in UI, in music discovery, and in social discovery. Um, so that that's one piece of it is, is the actual product innovation and in terms of business models. Uh, that remains to be seen, and I never would have predicted the Apple thirty percent cut of of uh, subscription revenue yes. that changes everything. Yes. And maybe they'll maybe they'll back off of that. Yeah. So I, I frankly don't know if I can really predict the long term. Uh, if I could, I <laughs> I would let you know. But, okay. Uh, yeah. All right, let's close with um, something more fun. Sure. What's one thing that people don't know about you? Uh, I think uh, one thing is I am from Texas, and I don't have a Texas accent. And uh, probably one other thing is I have a degree in psychology uh, from Stanford. And, uh, what were you going to do with that? I was interested in it. I, I actually thought about going to grad school and doing uh, research in cognitive, cognitive psychology and social psychology. Uh, I just found it personally interesting. Nice. It has a lot to do with social networks, right? Yeah, it's, absolutely. It's being interested in people and groups of people and, and just how people behave in large numbers. Um, so there's actually quite a bit of similar. Very cool. Yeah. All right, well, thanks, Dalton. Enjoy the rest of your South by Southwest, and yeah, thanks, thanks, for, so thanks for talking with us. Thanks.